my friend and welcome to my channel. Today I've got another manicure and this one is Square Hue Ling and I'm going to stamp over it with black. I started off with Neltique's Formula 2 and here is Square Hue Ling and we have topped it off with Sesh Vit so it would dry quickly. I'm going to be using Bundle Monster H05 and my Monocle Stamper and my Fabrinal Scraper. And I'm using my last little bit of Conad Black Polish. This gets thrown in the trash as soon as this manicure is done, because it is done for, guys. Done. <clears throat> and my nails are just a little long for this image, so I'm going to have to do some double stamping. Some lining it up. Get that out of the way. And, of course... The queen about a frame but anyway I'm having to do some double stamping because of my nail length so I'm just gonna grab just a little bit down on the end and pick that little bit up and I'm gonna try to line it up the best I can and find out which which angle looks good to me and just tap that on that one worked out pretty good. I didn't expect it to be perfect. Just turn out okay. Fiddling with that stamping plate. It's got to be sitting just so. See, you can tell I'm just getting so low. I've got other black stamping polishes. It's just a saw this one and decided let's just go in and use it up. I'm going to scrape the bottom of the barrel on that one. And I'm just trying to line this image up kind of down the center of my nail and plop it on there and then do just like I did on the other one. I'm going to pull just part of the image, the part that I need. This one up best I can. Not as good as the first one, but it's doable. We'll leave it. It'll work. <laughs> I talk with my hands, so it's okay. My hands are moving too fast for people to see that it's not perfect. And I guess on this Ling color, I was kind of torn. Do I like it? Do I not like it? There were times that I looked at it and I thought, ugh. And then other times I looked at it and I thought, well, that's kind of pretty. It's like a goldy orange, and then it's got little gold glitters in it. And it the glitters kind of floated to the top after the manicure dried down. And I think that's what made me like it a little bit more. Had a little bling going on. line this one up and that one's not near as good as the first two but I think I'm gonna leave it um, I'm just kind of over it and I know we've all had manicures like that <laughs> just do them just get them done get some polish on them digits <clears throat> There we go. Oh, I don't have to double stamp this one. Yay! <laughs> but I think overall the look was okay. Um, not my favorite manicure. You don't always end up with what you see in your head. and That was the case on this one. And I'm going to top this one off with some pure ice. Girl on the run. Capping those ends. Ta-da! And I guess for me in my book, this one was just okay. <clears throat> So here's my still photo. Looks way better in the picture, I think. 
Leave me a comment down below and let me know what you think about this one. Thanks for watching. Till next time, be good to yourself. Bye.